how are you all we know that you are getting tired listening of so many college reviews but trust me all these reviews will be important for you will be useful for you in the coming near future okay so which is why even we are putting our efforts full efforts into making college reviews for you guys yes so now let's talk about top 19th engineering college of karnataka which is sdm cet in dharwad and what is the highest package offered 43.94 which is pretty good hmm? average package if you talk it's 6.59 people say 6 bad no it's not bad why i'll tell you because during this economic crisis that is happening in our country obviously i cannot say that this is bad because there are a lot of people who are not getting paid this much as well okay so even after being uh, so old after working for so long they are not getting that much back it so you cannot say it's a bad number okay now if you talk about the placement rate it's 71.8% now that is unofficial rest everything is official unofficial data we tried to cross check with the company as well that is the college as well but it didn't work out okay now we go ahead we'll talk about all this later overview of the college the name of the college is sri dharmasthala manjunatheshwara college of engineering and technology year of establishment 1979 location in dharwad affiliation it is affiliated to vishweshwaraya technological university it's a good university it has an nirf ranking of 63 okay so you don't need to be worried about the university now placement record we spoke about two things that is highest and the average package you can see for yourself now number of companies that have visited is 65 okay it is what 65 number of offers being made is 431 now i want to give a clear cut idea so the 431 includes also the mtech people as well as mca people so if you minus deduct that it comes out to be 381 but why i didn't change it over here because you will be seeing a graph in uh, like one or two minutes so i didn't want you to be confused that the data is different here and different there so that's why i'm telling you it was the offer number of offers came out to be around 381 or something like that okay not beyond that yes now placement rate 71.8% which is okay not bad but we can look on to the official data that is of utmost importance right now children so you have defined department wise offers i'll be showing it to you and uh, there are three years that i took i just didn't take the 2024 data because i want some important thing to be told to you now over here if you see the number of offers the most number of offers is backed by csc that is computer science and engineering and after that comes ece that is electronics uh, electrical and communication engineering it has 67 and then comes iec that is information science and engineering it is 64 now that's all good but the thing that i want you to notice is if you see yearly the offers are getting reduced okay so that is one thing i want you to have in your mind okay so there can be couple of reasons but yes something that is a whole purpose of giving a review right for telling about everything so this is what i found over here i thought i'll share it with you as well this is of 2022 23 and 24 so number has increased rather than being uh, sorry decrease rather than being increased which is something that uh, bothered me a lot but there is a contradictory data over here that is if you talk about year wise placement performance it came out that over here that is uh, the offers number of offers is 431 and the number of companies visited is 65 which is pretty good that, that means number uh, a child might have got multiple offers so that is great but again if you see for the year this year the offers were quite more okay if you compare to other years fine but there's a trend it can change so for here for example here it was 591 it went down it went up it went down and again it is what basically it's a 69 685 now in the previous year which is not bad so we cannot uh, say that okay it will definitely happen this year as well but i want you to talk to your alumni like friends who are there who studied in this particular college once okay now this is the thing that i was talking about this is something contradictory that is the placement uh, wise highest package and everything it comes out that the average package has kept on increasing so now people are not settling for something less they are going aiming for something high as an average package so 6.59 in the previous year which is good okay and even if you talk about the highest package also it has come up to 43.94 
if you talk about the data that was years before it was 62 but it was not consistent over here it has found to be increasing so that is a sense of relief for children who want to definitely get into this particular college okay so apart from these data that i have showed you i want to tell you again and again talk to your friends who have studied in this particular college you will get a clear cut idea of a lot of things this is what we could find officially right so yes now let's go ahead we talk about the ranking nirf ranking is 250 it comes between 250 to 300 okay uh, nacc naac that is national assessment and accreditation it came out to a grade that is not bad it's good this is really good now mode of admission how can you get admission to this particular college you need to write k set or comet k no other options management is always there but it's not an option for us right now for k set fino it is a uh, one lakh seven thousand four hundred ninety five for Comet K, if you see, it ranges from this 1,25,000 to 2,92,000, something, something. Why I wrote this particular range? Because this is what they exactly published in their official website. So, I have a snip for that. I'll show it to you. You will also get a clear-cut idea if you are an aspirant of Comet K. If you're writing, you have written Comet K and you're waiting for your, uh, for say, counseling and everything, then it will help you out. So, I hope the k guys saw this. Okay. Now, let's talk about comet k fee so over here you see the branch the tuition fee other fee this fee that fee so for karnataka students this is the fee for each courses for example if you talk about electronics and communication engineering their fees is 2,92,087 after everything okay if we talk about the lowest it is for chemical engineering it is 1,25,000 okay now what do i want to say this is for karnataka students now for non karnataka students the university fees is 12000 uh, 12110 so here the university fee will be changing to 12110 and then you can calculate by your own self just replace uh, this by 12110 and then you can calculate the whole thing you will get the idea of what is the fees for this particular course if you are appeared through comet k and you are not a karnataka student okay I hope this helped. You can take a snip of it if you want. I'll just move aside. Okay. So for your help, I did it. And for uh, children who are foreign students, this number increases to 12,110 uh, again. Okay. So if it's not clear, you can tell me. I can put down in the comment box again, this picture or something like that. I can try to somehow manage it. Okay. That's all. Let's move ahead. Let's see the courses that are being offered by this particular college. We have these many courses starting from artificial intelligence and machine learning and ending at mechanical engineering. If you see, these are the number of seats being offered for each course. So, for example, 120 children could only take admission for mechanical engineering since only 120 seats are there. Okay, same thing for each of the courses. Now, if you talk about the case set rank as well as Comet K rank, over here you have everything. Let me help it. So, over here, if you see, Computer Science and Engineering has the highest cutoff value. Why do I say highest cutoff value? Because this range is too much. My rank should be below 12,241. Then only I can take admission for Computer Science and Engineering. Whereas, if you talk about the lowest cutoff, this is this, like 1,98,623. So, obviously, my rank, if I tried a little bit, my rank could have been below this. So, there are high chances for me to get into this particular course. So, which is why this lower number is the highest cutoff value and this number is the lowest cutoff value. So, it's opposite. Okay? I hope you got it. Your rank should be below the number, which is why you can, that is how you can get admission to the particular course. Right? Now, if you talk about Comet K, same thing. Which one has the highest cutoff value? Tell, tell, tell. You see for yourself and tell me. It will be obviously Computer Science and Engineering with 22,355 as the cutoff rank. Right? Now, over here, Electrical and Electronics Engineering, it has 57,327, which is the lowest cutoff rank. And it has went for Electrical and Electronics Engineering, as I said already. Now, if you want to get admission to this college, you're not bothered about the course, which should not be the case. Then, your rank should lie in between this range. So, for case at aspirant, okay, it should be between, okay, there's a slight change in the number. Just a second. Okay, I can write like this. Where shall I write? Over here, I'll write. Your rank should be between 12241. 
one lakh ninety eight thousand six hundred twenty three. This is for K set. If you talk about comet K, what your rank should be? Again, it should be. Oh, that was correct. Okay, just a second. It should be between twenty two thousand three hundred fifty five to fifty seven thousand three hundred twenty four. So your rank should be coming here. Okay. So K set aspirants, you can check for this rather than this. Okay. Now, obviously, there is no use of all this thing because the cutoff will be changing this year. But this is a tentative thing that happened previous year, so you also get a clear cut idea of what you need to do, right? Yes. Now, case it college code is E zero three four. Common K college code is E one one seven. So, children who are appearing for case it, you should put this code. Children who are appearing for common K, you should be putting this code. I hope it helps. So I thought of adding Comet K as well since I thought poor children are not, oh, let's say, are needing some help. So yeah, we have facilities provided. What are the facilities provided by the college? We have hostel facilities, guys. And what is the fees? This is the fees. So hostel fees is rupees twenty nine thousand four hundred fifty. Mess advance is rupees thirty three thousand. And the total ho hotel hostel fees. Oh, I said hotel. <laughs> yes, but it does not have any. Features like hotel, okay? It's just a hostel. Hostel will be a hostel. So it's rupees sixty-two thousand four hundred fifty. So if you are a candidate who wants to get admission to the hostel, you need to pay this much amount, okay? And this is for first-year students. It's not for other students. Fine. So that's all, children. Now over here, did you put all your preferences in the correct order, or did you mess it up? Well. There might be still a chance to correct it. Correct your mistakes. Add your points. Everything. Do everything possible. Okay. So and do not be panicked about every anything and everything. It's all good. It's all calm. We will somehow manage it. Okay. And over here, children, we have certain videos, very important videos, and uh, I have put two more new things. That is, there are seven mistakes that you should be avoid. You should be avoiding while case of choice filling, a uh, counseling. So do that. Okay. Now over here. How to make the best option entry list? So most children are very confused. Like as I said, the question was: Have you prepared the uh, preference? Like what is your order of preference? If you are not made, and if you do not have any idea, you can watch her video. She'll help you out. Okay. As well as if you know, want to know about the best college as well as the best branch for you, you can see those videos as well. Right. Now, thank you, children. That's all from my end for today. So if you like this video if you think it was useful do not forget to like share and subscribe and we are here to help you in ways that are possible to us right so take care do not stop smiling always be happy bye bye